The NK-3825 mm chain gun, known as Bushmaster, is a navalized version of the chain gun. It is an externally powered weapon developed by Hughes for the U.S. Army as the MK-242. The MK-38 replaced the obsolete 20mm MK-67 guns, which had high maintenance requirements. The Army's MK-242 gun entered service in the 1970s, followed by the Navy's MK-38 in 1988. Since then, the NK-38 has served aboard a variety of combatant and auxiliary ships in escort mission for the Middle East Force operations, as well as during operations Desert Shield and Desert Storm. The NK-38 25mm machine gun is an automatic gun system that provides ships with a defensive and offensive gunfire capability for the engagement of a variety of surface targets. This gun is designed to provide close-range defense against patrol boats, swimmers, floating mines, and various targets ashore including enemy personnel, lightly armored vehicles, and terrorist threats. It took a long time for this gun to be accepted into USN ships. The Chief of Naval Operations authorized their usage in 1977 to replace old 20mm Mark 16 guns that were difficult to maintain and used non-standard NATO ammunition. However, it was not until the summer of 1987 that the gun was operationally examined for naval usage. Then, because of the pressing need for such weapons in the Persian Gulf, the weapons manufacture was substantially increased. The Naval Weapons Support Center crane which designed the Mark 88 mounting, was responsible for most of the essential work. The weapons are kept in a rotatable pool, available for temporary installation on various deploying ships and permanent installation on certain amphibious and auxiliary ships and Coast Guard cutters. In the event of a major malfunction, the gun can be removed from the mount and another one installed in its place in five minutes by two personnel as the MK-88 is manually trained and lacks stabilization. Target tracking is difficult when the machine gun system is used on a small combatant ship. As a result, the Navy started a program to develop a low-cost, remotely controlled and stabilized version designated as the MK-38 Mod 2. Several improvements compared to the MK-38 include an on-mount electro-optical sight, improved ammunition loading, improved man-machine interface, an embedded trainer, and ship roll compensation. The new system has the capability to have two different ammunition types loaded and selecting between them from the remote console. The remote operator console is a 12-inch color LCD equipped with 12 soft keys. The picture on the computer screen is extremely clear, displaying a real-time 360-degree, 6,400 to 7,300 meters picture. In 2003, the Chief of Naval Operations documented the requirement and directed the development and fielding of the MK-38 Mod 2. Installed aboard CG, DDG, FFG, LSD, LPD, LHD, LHA, LCC, PC, OSV, and USCG FRC class ships and planned for installation aboard CVN, AS, and MK-6 class ships, the NK-38 Mod 2 machine gun system is a low-cost, stabilized self-defense weapon system that dramatically improves ships' self-defense capabilities. As the last update, the United Defense was granted a $395.5 million contract to manufacture the MK-38 Mod 2 missile system in 2004. The contract lasted until 2010, with the first eight units and spares arriving in 2004, 13 in 2005, and 67 in 2006. Anyway, if you find this video interesting, don't forget to like, share, comment, and the most important one is to hit the subscribe button for more updates on awesome videos. That's all for today. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next episode.